Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, we're gonna follow up on a previously reviewed item here on my channel. That item are these shoes right here, the Axe Boxing Men's Athletic Shoes. If you're interested in this product, be sure to watch my original unboxing and review video. And you can also find the link to this item in my video description below. So please go ahead, check it out and do your shopping from there. Now let's just jump right in. Let's talk about the shoes, my experience, and how the wear and tear is held up, and how they look for being almost six months old, being worn every day, and getting hundreds, if not thousands, of miles already walked in these shoes, because I wear them everywhere, around the house, around the yard, to run errands. My wife and I hike a lot. I walk my dog, Doug, just about every day, so that's probably you know three, three miles or so every day, just on our nice walk that we do. And so, yeah, like guys, let's just look at the shoe. So here is the right foot shoe right here. The shoelaces are still flawless. So those held up great. The tongue's nice too. On the inside, you can see maybe a little bit of wear and tear right around the sticker for the shoe size, but they look great. Right there in the camera, I wanna point out, you can see right there, you can see some wear in the fabric. It started to tear, but that's not bad. Look around the rest of the shoe, the heel, everything's still in there everything on the bottom. Then we can kind of do some of the sides right here. Nothing worn out on that side, maybe a little bit right here and along the back. We can see the back of the shoe. And then here's this side as well. For being a budget athletic shoe on Amazon, I'm definitely impressed with the quality of the shoes. Like I said, I wear them every day. So definitely impressed with that overall. So this is the right foot. And then here's the bottom. So you can see on the sole where it's really started to wear. So we got the rubber peeling up right there. A lot of the traction and grip is lost down here. You can see all that from the camera. So they are really well worn down there at the sole. And then there's the tip as well too. So they're great. You can see that. Again, this has had a lot of use, but nothing's ripped, no holes, nothing like that. Just a little bit of wear right there. And then obviously you can see the bottom and how they are worn out. Now we can look at the left foot shoe right here. So obviously the first thing I see is the top part of this tongue, whatever you want to call it, came loose. I have no idea why. You can see the other one isn't. Maybe at some point it got caught in something and ripped, but the glue, the seam, whatever, it has come undone right there. But looking along the sides, no rips, no frays in the fabric. So that looks great. You can see on this side too, we have the same wear that we had on the other side from the right foot. This one's even worse right there. No dog chewed it or anything. That's just worn out from the use. So everything else looks good on the inside. Nothing's worn, no holes. Here's the back of the shoe. We can see the side again. And then again, the bottom. So the bottom's gonna be your key right there where it's really worn out. And they have lost a lot of their traction and grip due to having so many miles on them. They both have this same spot coming up too. You can see that right there. So that's definitely something probably in how I walk and the wear and the materials used in manufacturing. So I know it's kind of gross to have dirty shoes here on the channel. Now they're making a mess on the table, but I want to show you guys what they look like so you can get a good feel for yourself and maybe know what you can expect five or six months in if you have a really active lifestyle. I can't stress that enough. I have no way to measure how many miles I put on this, but like I said, I wore them every day major hikes, that sort of thing. So they have covered a lot of ground. So they could have worn prematurely just because I wore them so frequently. But I still wear them. I'm not throwing them out. I'm going to keep using them. They're in my main shoe lineup right now. So definitely impressed. Kind of give you a little side by side too. So you can see some interesting spots that I've worn on each shoe. Both have a little bit of wear on the back too in that same spot. So let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions that I missed in this follow-up. I'd love to hear from you guys. Also, any recommendations on other shoes I should review or check out on Amazon. I love looking at cheap stuff that you can basically buy, wear for five or six months, throw away, that sort of thing. I don't want to spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on shoes because crap happens all the time and I'd rather not deal with it with an expensive pair of shoes. If I spill on them, they get muddy, dirty. I wanna be able to use a shoe just about anywhere. So that's kind of my mentality. Let me know if you have any recommendations in the comment section below. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this follow-up video. Hit that like button for me, subscribe to our channel and turn notifications on. We have new content coming out daily and don't want you guys to miss anything. Thank you again for being here. Give us a follow on social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Message us on WeChat. 
check out our website and join our free newsletter. Please don't hesitate to reach out to any questions, comments, or concerns below. I'd be happy to hear from you guys, try to help you or point you in the right direction. Thank you again for watching. Don't forget new content daily. Can't wait to see you in our next video.